every school needs a library. Sadly, this was what the library at our adopted school, Thurgood Marshall, looked like. It looked so old and nobody really used it. Tonight, you'll witness an amazing transformation. The abandoned library turned into a high-tech literacy lounge. Hank and his team getting some big help from a Detroit sports star who is dedicated to helping children in the city. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester takes you inside Thurgood Marshall to reveal the new room. Hank? This project was really big, and we knew we needed a team to really make this happen. And as you will see, that team came through. When we first walked into what was the library here at Thurgood Marshall, it was downright depressing. How could children learn in a room that's cluttered, cramped, and so outdated? It looked so old and nobody really used it. Over the years, this room basically became a storage room. Old books filling the shelves, covering the tables. We only came here like two or three times and read a few books. Oh, more backpacks. We knew for this transformation, we needed help. Lots of help. My local four colleagues pitching in and helping me clear all the clutter. A crew from Hire at Dawn working to remove old bookcases. And then the team from Five Star Painting in Ortonville stepping in along with Sherwin Williams, which donated all of the paint to give the room a fresh look. Working in a library is our way to give the excitement back to the kids. Hopefully they will get excited when they come and see all the changes. Slides to the paint. Sense but we were sport. only able to get the ball rolling here Just because like of this guy. Reggie Jackson drives, reverses and scores. Detroit Pistons star Reggie Jackson and his determined to assist foundation supporting literacy projects in Detroit, wanting Thurgood to have a new high-tech literacy lounge. I just want to have an impact on the entire city and um, change the world but start here by changing um, the outlook for the kids here in Detroit. Assisting with a major financial contribution, Bank of America. The team there committed to giving back and helping transform this space. I have the benefit of living not far from here, um, within a mile of this school, and I'm proud that I can say that our team invested in this school because it does make a difference. Finally, after weeks of hard work, the big day arrived. Reggie getting a hero's welcome in the hallway. And inside the new literacy lounge. One, two, three. A new look. Hundreds of new books, iPads, computers, bookcases, rugs, furniture, all creating the perfect space for moments just like this one. Is this George? No. You sure? With this project, an important lesson for these students. Sometimes it really does take a village. They now have the tools they need to learn to grow. A new safe space designed just for them. From a team of people that want nothing more than to see every student here succeed. For them to say, I think enough of Detroit Public Schools Community District to come out and help Thurgood Marshall really makes me happy. And Reggie Jackson, he'll be back as a guest reader at Thurgood Marshall. And the team at Bank of America, they're also coming back to teach the students and the parents about money management. A big thanks to everyone who helped us make this one happen. I'm Hank Winchester. Help me, Hank. Great, the way people are, are rising to the occasion here. The library was my favorite part of the building when I was in elementary school. It's magical. Uh, that's right.